Many of us dream about traveling the world, but a young man from St. Paul just made that dream a reality. Adam Swanson got back last week from biking and backpacking through 20 countries during nearly two years on the road. David Schumann spoke to Adam about how the trip of a lifetime changed him. I had 120 degree heat in the desert of Uzbekistan, blizzards on hiking trips in Patagonia. I slept through an earthquake. Adam Swanson left his home in St. Paul for 22 months, just him and his bike. It's my baby. From Europe to Asia to South America, Adam saw 20 countries on his adventures. That's more than the number of years he's been alive. There was my gap year between high school and college, so I left when I was 17. I'm kind of looking at it as my first couple of years of education, informal education to get to learn about the world and different cultures. He carried his whole life with him on the bike, staying sometimes in hostels, but mostly at campsites or even just the side of the road. It's fun. It's like a game I play every night. I've learned that you don't need much to be happy. Adam learned more than just that. A lot of the best moments in life come when you're not expecting it. So it's important to keep yourself open and open to opportunities. Even though he was alone most of the time, he credits the trip for bringing him out of his shell. Talking to strangers, often across a language barrier, will do that. Seeing my own son just go out there and just make the most of it and you know, start to find who he is in a time where like so many kids are struggling with that, it was just a real positive, good feeling. And one more important lesson for travelers. In Thailand, you could get a five-star hotel for 10 bucks a night. That's just smart planning. In St. Paul, David Schumann, WCCO News. Adam says the trip cost about $19,000, which he paid for by working multiple jobs and saving up. He's going to the University of Minnesota in the fall and is already planning next summer's bike trip.